You know Fist of the North Star, right? That buff anime that maybe inspired Jojo's Bizarre Adventure? I mean, objection hearsay. But do you know that there is a prequel to Fist of the North Star called Fist of the Blue Sky? The story takes place in 1930s China, more specifically Shanghai, and centers around the main protagonist, Kenshiro Kasumi, the 62nd successor of the Hokuto Shinken martial arts style. Kenshiro is both a name and a title given to only the most chattest of men in the world, defined through their birthmarks on the top of their head and the thick plot armor that they carry on their shoulders. Fist of the Blue Sky is very much a focused narrative and while its sequel is set in a barren wasteland after a nuclear apocalypse, i.e. Mad Max but way cooler, Fist of the Blue Sky takes a different approach and is very much focused on building a story around the tumultuous time period, especially in relation to what is going on in China and Japan at the time. It cuts out the Mel Gibson for Jojo Part 2 instead. I mean, let's talk about the visuals. You know, what can I say? Truly beautiful inked artwork by none other than Tetsu Hara, who has proven time and time again that he's the god of drawing manly men. But with Buon Sen, the god of coming up with the most bizarre shit imaginable, like a little old someone. If you want to have some good fun like you did in Fist of the North Star, I highly suggest you check this one out too.